Hello, I'm Gina and I'm the Chief of Product of Ovuline, the maker of the Ovia Fertility and Ovia Pregnancy apps. I'm also 25 weeks pregnant and I'd love to talk to you about what's going on with our babies and our bodies this week in our pregnancies. This week, baby has really grown. It's about the size of a Napa cabbage. Uh, so almost 14 inches long and weighing in like just under two pounds. Uh, so baby's really getting big and it's important to remember it's the length, not the width, uh, because if it were both, it, that'd be a little scary at this point. <laughs> this week, the baby's hair is thickening and the hair might also have color, uh, although you, you can't see it and the hair color might even change after delivery. It's, uh, nostrils are starting to open and developing the air sacs in its lungs to help uh, after delivery. And since baby's lungs are continuing to produce that surfactant, it has a greater likelihood of surviving a preterm delivery at this point, which is really great. The baby is also developing developing balance and is starting to know which way is up, which way is down, and is even using that skill to prepare its body for the birth position. Some symptoms you might expect this week, uh, gas, hemorrhoids, constipation, you know, all the really, really good ones. <laughs> you know, hemorrhoids are pretty common during pregnancy. A lot of women in Ovia report it uh, starting around now. Um, and they're caused really by your expanding uterus, putting pressure on the veins in your rectum. And gas, you know, that can be attributed to all that extra progesterone in your system that is really slowing down your gastrointestinal tract. A way to prevent hemorrhoids is uh, doing your Kegels. Uh, Kegels are great. They're really easy to do. I mean, you can do them at work. You can do them during yoga. You can do it right now. <laughs> I might be doing one right now. They're great and what they do is they strengthen your pelvic muscles and your anal muscles. So uh, it's it's really great for preventing hemorrhoids. My week uh, 25 of pregnancy was pretty, pretty easy. Uh, it was pretty nice. I spent a lot of time thinking about the baby actually coming and all of the things I'm gonna need to do uh, to prepare, uh, which is a little scary. A high for me this week, I was definitely giving in to all the different pregnancy cravings. I mean, I, I really gave in this week. <laughs> I think all my colleagues are making fun of me for just the, the fix of Oreos and candy and jar of Nutella at my desk. Low for me this week was not exercising. Um, you know, I've been trying to be good and exercise is so important during pregnancy, but a really hard time motivating myself to go running this week. I'm starting to feel it in my lack of energy levels and, and sore and soreness in my joints. So I think what I'll try next week or this week hopefully is to switch it up, try a different exercise um, if I don't feel that motivation to do my normal stuff product that I really loved this week was Tums. I've been experiencing a lot of heartburn, uh, and which is a big pregnancy symptom. Uh, so I think I'm, I'm getting that heartburn half due to pregnancy and half due to all the junk food I've been eating. I've even caught my husband sneaking the Tums recently. Um, and when I asked him, you know, are you experiencing heartburn, some sympathy pregnancy symptoms? And he replied that it tastes like candy. An app feature that I absolutely loved this week were the articles. I, you know, I love reading the articles in Ovia, and this week I had some really fun ones from, you know, music playing, uh, playing music for the baby to the myths behind pregnancy sex. Uh, so I had some really good ones. I love them this week. Please come back for next week's episode. We're going to talk all about uh, baby's eyes opening up as well as the weight gain that we're about to experience. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, working at Ovuline, I have the incredible opportunity to be a part of millions of women's pregnancies every day. And it's really cool that you're taking a part of mine as well.